And another story that is new tonight, this program might kind of look like a video game, but it's actually helping us better understand wildfires here in New Mexico. Not only that, but also how to safely do prescribed burns. Los Alamos National Lab recently worked with a Santa Fe based company to use virtual reality technology to understand how fires start and spread. Jonathan, uh, Jonathan Field shows us how the technology really works. Picture yourself putting on a VR headset and finding yourself in the thick of a wildfire. Sounds scary? It's actually more useful than you think. Fire managers, trainees, and scientists are using what they call Fire Vista to simulate fires based on factors such as terrain, fuel, and wind speeds. Predicting wind gusts or even the amount of sun exposure that fuels have had before uh, a fire arrives can be really important for predicting how intense that fire is. In 2022, the U.S. government faced backlash for starting a prescribed burn that grew to become the largest wildfire in New Mexico state history. Just as that fire changed the way managers view prescribed burns, this technology could too. With a list of tree locations and tree types, we can build a full 3D canopy fuel model. We can then just choose where to ignite a fire within the quick fire simulation, carry it forward however long we want, and then look at the effects on the fuels in a 3D sense. People from multiple agencies can virtually stand in a fire and see how and why it spreads. They can also determine how safe a burn may be based on what they see. They believe that can make everyone more confident, including people in New Mexico who lost trust in the Forest Service after the Calf Canyon Hermit's Peak fire. We have much more opportunity with this quick fire model and our visualizers for them to come to an understanding as a team, as a group with all the experts at the table to come to those decisions to say when we burn, how we burn, and then getting the community involved of why we burn. Jonathan Field, KOB.